uh, hi all good morning uh, welcome to tosca training in today's session we'll be focusing on a concept like how to install tosca uh, what are the advantages of using tosca process okay so tosca is a tool it is an automation tool developed by a company called tricentis it was developed in the year 2007 it is in the market for more than 10 years but it became popular for the last 5 years the current version of tosca is 12 it supports both manual as well as automation testing it supports both gui as well as non gui based applications okay uh, and coming to ga also it will unlike selenium which uh, works only on the web based application tosca works on both web as well as the desktop based application not only gui uh, but it also supports non gui like uh, xml json api testing okay it also supports erp applications like sap it is also used for mobile testing and it also supports load testing tosca supports more than 100 plus technologies okay uh, it's, it's it, uh, when i'm talking about tosca it's a test suite right so it's not only an automation tool it is also a test management tool as well as a management tool so basically for writing our requirements uh, in the industry we use either quality center or jira uh, we execute the test cases uh, in quality center and jira okay in jira there is a plugin called as cypher by installing that plugin uh, you can execute you can create your test cases and you can execute your test cases you can map or you can link your requirements uh, to test cases you can link your bugs to test cases uh, you can perform test planning all these activities are performed in tools like uh, uh, quality center and jira the same thing can be done in tosca okay and you have one important section in tosca called as the requirement section so basically it will tell you the percentage of the test cases written for a particular requirement and whenever you are writing in test cases in tosca right they are easy to understand readable they all are readable test cases okay so another two another reason why Tosca is becoming popular is it supports variety of technologies okay so there is a big list uh, uh, which supports uh, which I am going to show next so before that like uh, it, it supports multiple browsers like it supports Chrome browser Internet Explorer as well as the Firefox browser it supports multiple operating systems like uh, I iOS mobile operating systems like iOS and Android it also supports continuous integration some of the popular tools like bamboo jenkins and team city and uh, it supports more than 100 plus technologies so i have a list like uh, like it supports sap gui microsoft.net visual basics ms excel silverlight okay i have a link uh, i have documented this link uh, which shows uh, this is by tricentis website which shows that the technologies which is supported by tosca we look at here uh, integration when it comes to integration it can be integrated with jira salesforce as well as jmeter okay it supports all the databases like uh, oracle mysql sql server uh, let me go to the first uh, page see it supports out systems pega oracle abs jenkins soap ui service now even a selenium test can also be run in tosca supports jmeter oracle track postman xsd it supports xml visdel wpf and almost all the sap application like sap netviewer sap hana sap gui sap gui SAP Flory, uh, Salesforce, and uh, people, Oracle PeopleSoft, uh, Oracle HRMS, Oracle 11G, like this. Uh, there are, it supports more than 100 plus technologies. Okay, so it's a very powerful tool. Okay, and coming to the system requirements, like uh, generally we require a CPU uh, of uh, 2.4 gigahertz processing speed, and uh, we require a RAM which is of 8 GB. This is, because it's a heavy tool, it requires minimum 8 GB of RAM space. 
and we require a hard disk uh, which which uh, which is of 5 gb and a network speed of 100 mbps because we have to download uh, download the software and also we need to test the applications okay and uh, coming to tosca right tosca is developed using uh, .net okay so .net framework need to be installed in our system uh, to run the tosca so if framework is not installed right it to, while installing tosca it will automatically get the framework okay uh, this is how it will do you need not worry if the framework is not there it will automatically install the framework and it supports both 32 bit as well as 64 bit uh, systems of windows 7 windows 8 windows 8.1 and windows 10 okay and uh, whenever you you can work in two modes one is a single user mode and the other one is multi user mode see in single user mode you don't require a database support a multi user mode that means multiple people will be working on tosca at the same time okay so when multiple users are trying to access the tosca you have to take a support of a database so here the database which we are using are uh, it can be sql server databases 2005 2008 2012 Oracle databases like Oracle 11G, 12C, DB2, even it supports uh, Postgre and MySQL. Okay. And what are the steps? Uh, what are the steps to download Tosca? Open the official website. Okay. Open the official website of Tosca.com. So basically this is the first screen you, you see it is uh, tosca gives you a 14 day free trial okay enter some email id a valid email id because they send a an email uh, to the uh, they, they send a download link to the uh, entered email id uh, for for i have already installed i am giving a, a demo email id test.com okay so click on get started the moment you say uh, get started right it will ask you for some more details like your salutation mr mrs uh, all these things first name last name what job title you are and what is your role in the current company which company you are working for what is the country what is the phone number and here you have to uh, create an account right so you have to provide the username and password uh, sorry, you, you have to provide your password user uh, ID will be your email ID and you have to click on the I, I read uh, Accept of terms and conditions and I, I want to hear about the latest innovations and Trust into so software testing. This is what you have to click on it. So this is the second screen which you see Okay, once you enter all the valid details uh, all the mandatory data and click on the submit button uh, You will be taken to this page like uh, thank you uh, we will review your trial request and contact you shortly and an email will be sent uh, to the entered email id from trial at the rate uh, trustinterest.com okay like this or it will automatically download okay in your in your browser it will automatically download uh, so once you download it right uh, once you download it once you click on download uh, button it will take you to the start page okay so this is how generally start page is there the tosca start page So basically this is what you see this is the start page or the home page uh, where it talks about what are the new features uh, uh, and what is the news of, uh, latest news about Tosca and getting started like uh, basically it will show you what are the Udemy courses available uh, what is Tosca trial uh, like this uh, it, it, it will show you okay it will show you all these things uh, like uh, the, there is a free course available uh in tosca also in order my website and also it will show you like uh, <coughs> uh how to work with tosca like uh, it also provides you some sample sample videos related to manual testing uh they are related to x scan uh, uh, it, it, it provides like how to execute manual test cases and there are sample videos provided uh, by tosca around four to five videos and uh, also they it will show you like what are the system requirements like uh, uh, this is what I have discussed right what is the CPU size uh, what is the CPU and the RAM size all these things and finally what we have to do is like we have to install Tosca right so how do it also shows you the Tosca installation which I am going to discuss now 
so let me discuss installing of the Tosca. So the moment you click on download, right, the exe file will be given to you. Okay, it's a zip file. Uh, unzip that file and double click on the exe file. The demo purpose I'm showing 9.3, but the latest version is 12.2. Okay, the moment you double click on the exe file, you, you will be shown a window like called as preparing to install. Okay, uh, after this, you will see a setup window. Click on the next button. And then you will be shown the license agreement window uh, will be displayed. So here I, I select I uh, accept the terms and conditions and navigate to next. Here there are there are three types of licenses. One is the trial license. Other one is a customer who has purchased Tosca. Third one is a com committee license. Okay. So basically, since I'm using trial version, I'm clicking on this button. And uh, next you will be navigated to a new window called as Tosca diagnostic window uh, by default this option will be checked and you cannot uncheck this option okay click on the next button so you it will navigate to the destination folder like uh, what is the where you want to install the Tosca just uh, leave the default path and it will install in C program files try centers uh, Tosca test folder Finally, it will ask you like uh, the next window, you will see an option to change the projects folder location. So basically in Tosca, you will be creating a project and you will be uh, uh, adding your test cases to a particular project. So if you want uh, to change the project location, you can change it. So the default project location is C Tosca projects. Okay. The next button is like uh, you have the ready to install one. Just uh, clear once you click on next, you will be navigated to this particular window and click on install and it will install Tosca okay so once uh, Tosca while installing Tosca it will ask you to log in if you have already created the login uh, while re while downloading right you have entered the e email valid email id and, and you have created a password right just enter that uh, email id and the password and next window is like uh, if the license is valid uh, then you will be saying that uh, license is available and uh, your uh, login will be successful okay after that in order to see the effect you have to restart your system and once you restart the system right this is how the Tosca will be installed it has some some tools like uh, commander executor and wizard license and sample application so this is how we install Tosca trial license okay and uh, from the home page like if you, if you observe right like uh, installing tosca the same thing is been documented and coming to the architecture let 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 me show you this okay so what are the system requirements how to install the same thing has been documented here and uh, what type of features like if you are if you are going to purchase the customer product right you can even customize it like uh, server so rest aci tosca analytics distribution server and what are configurations you want to do uh, where you want to install the tosca server this is for it's not these options are not available in trial uh, these are available in the paid version okay and uh, see this is the architecture uh, of tosca like you have a repository uh, where all your projects and test cases will be stored you have a a license service because your Tosca is a licensed tool so it will check for the valid license and the main tool is the commander okay the moment uh, you open your Tosca right uh, see uh, Tosca is installed in my system uh, the main tool is the commander okay so this is where you so you create your test cases you execute your test cases so from commander it will go to executor where you can execute any type of applications related to sap html tcp or any other engines and you have something called as tosca wizard okay and even it can be integrated with the build or build tools uh, this we'll talk later okay so tosca is a complete test automation tool you can design your test cases you can create modules you can you can create your requirements you can generate your reports you can run your test cases you can build your test cases so this is how we can install tosca in our system